A man admits he played a role in another man's murder. Timothy Ballard pled guilty today to charges connected the 2013 beating death of Alex Johnson in Lexington. As WKYT's Mark Barber shows us, part of the plea deal means Ballard will have to testify against the other person charged in the case. Timothy Ballard will not be going to court because he has accepted a plea deal. This morning he pleaded guilty to kidnapping and tampering with evidence. As part of the deal, a persistent felony charge against him was dropped. While Ballard will not be going to trial, he will be heading back to court in June to testify against Mark Taylor. Ballard is accused of helping Taylor persuade Alex Johnson to get into a car back in December of 2013. Investigators say Taylor then beat Johnson to death and dumped his body in the Kentucky River. The 32-year-old was found in a barrel near a restaurant on Old Richmond Road a month later. Court papers do not give any indication of what may have motivated the murder of the Lexington man who worked as a chef for the University of Kentucky. This morning, the Commonwealth recommended that Ballard serve a 20-year sentence for kidnapping Johnson and a five-year sentence for tampering with evidence. When asked about those charges in court, Ballard quietly told the judge he was driving the car that was carrying Johnson. Taylor is charged with murder in the case. He will go to trial on June 6th. A judge will sentence Ballard after the trial ends. In Lexington, Mark Barber, WKYT. Ballard's sentencing is set for July 1st.